Tyler Lydon is a name familiar to SU basketball fans. He's playing professionally right now, while his older brother, Zach, continues to carve out his own path right here at home. CBS 5's Matt Hawsworth reports. With the 24th pick in the 2017 NBA Draft, the Utah Jazz select Tyler Lydon from Syracuse University. Syracuse basketball fans remember Tyler Lydon like it was yesterday. But what you may or may not know is that there's another Lydon starring for another team in central New York. I am Zach Lydon. I'm the older brother of former Syracuse star Tyler Lydon, and this is my story. The story begins in Elizaville, New York, in the Hudson Valley region, roughly between Albany and New York City. My mom played college basketball. She was a high school super, a star at her school. She scored an, over 1,000 points. And so it began. Basketball became the sport of choice inside the Lydon household. My mom would always come outside and she would teach us to shoot. She would never let us shoot threes. She'd always make sure that we had a, you know, a shot above our head and didn't want us thrown from the hip type of thing. But it was always, uh, every day was a competition. It's that competitive spirit that drove Tyler and Zach to a berth in the 2013 Class C New York State Championship game for Pine Plains High School. Gets it to Zach Lydon who lays it in. A game they would ultimately lose to Lake George. It was awesome. I mean, we had a really good team. We were, were a really small school, a Class C school, so to have the talent that we had and the size that we had with them being both 6'9", I'm 6'4 point guard, so we had a lot of talent. We had a lot of size. That is Justin Cooper, a high school teammate of the Lydons and now a teammate of Zach's at Cortland State. Let's, let's continue like our high school legacy to the college level and decided let's come to Cortland. The Carrier Dome is a place the Lydon family is quite familiar with. Of course, Tyler spending two years here at Syracuse University before ultimately being drafted into the NBA. Meanwhile, his brother Zach telling me that, yes, he did have a chance to play here at SU, but ultimately decided to carve out his own path. No matter which path either Lydon brother decides to take, though, Central New York will always be their second home. I would say that the best part about it is that I was still able to be close enough to my brother that I would go up and see him on weekends. I went to every home game I could have possibly went to. Family. It's the only thing that matters to the Lydons. And the night Tyler was drafted... I was honestly so happy that I, I cried. His decision, I think, was the right decision. There was a little, there was a little bit of uh, talk in the household of leaving after his freshman year, after the great run that they had. I've never seen a kid grow so fast. His three-point shot looks better than I've ever seen. It's quicker, faster. And he absolutely trusts the process 100%. It's a story of brothers living out their dreams, thanks to a family structure second to none. Reporting in Cortland, I'm Matt Hosworth. And Matt is with us now. It's so, um, I'm always struck by sibling pride. Yeah. Um, it, and, and in this case, it's so interesting because this is the same sport for both of these guys. One yeah. now doing it at a very, very high level. Yes. And one still in college here. There's no, there's no rivalry. <laughs> there's, I mean, there's really no, oh. Well, Zach was saying he did go out to Denver and he said they still play pickup basketball on, in the driveway. He said it was still very competitive. You know, his I mother bet. did play college basketball. So the roots run deep with yeah. the Lydons. I it will say, in though, the blood. Yes, of course. I will say, though, about Tyler, yeah. he did uh, suffer a torn lateral meniscus just last month. He was playing for Rio Grande Valley of the G League. He's out for four months. Mm. So uh, we tried to reach out uh, to the Denver Nuggets, who he plays for now. Our calls were unreturned. Uh, but, you know, we did uh, get to talk to Zach, and Zach, of course, w was great. Um, and, and, you know, obviously, he's so proud of his younger brother, Tyler, uh, playing in the professional uh, NBA now. So We wish them great. both the best. Mm -hmm. Matt, thanks for the story.